nine strongest tiger species that ever existed. Although there is only one tiger species, each type of tiger is considered a subspecies. A subspecies is a group within a species that is physically or genetically distinct from the rest of the species. Tigers are classified into nine subspecies or types, three of which are now extinct. Tigers are one of the most magnificent and brave wild animals alive today. Far East Russia, parts of North Korea, China, India, Southwest Asia, and the Indonesian island of Sumatra are home to the world's largest cat species. However, the human population has grown and encroached on tiger habitats, causing their territory to decrease. All tigers have been listed as endangered due to habitat loss, illegal killing, and a shrinking food supply. Tiger populations have declined by about 95% over the last century, and tigers now live in 40% of the area they did just a decade ago. While tigers can be identified by their distinctive stripes and massive size, not all of these big cats are the same. In fact, each tiger stripe pattern is as unique as a human fingerprint. Before we start this video, I would like to introduce you to our new channel, Four-Legged Friends. If you have a pet, a dog, or a cat, this channel is for you, even if you want a pet in the future. So if you want to find out useful information about our furry friends, I invite you to subscribe and watch the videos on the channel. Thank you. Now let's find out which are the strongest tiger subspecies that ever lived. Number 9. Barley Tiger The world's last barley tiger died sometime in the 1950s. However, the subspecies was not officially declared extinct until 2008. These tigers could only be found on the Indonesian island of Bali. Males could reach 7.7 .7 feet, 2.34 meters in length, and weigh up to 220 pounds, 100 kilograms. Females could reach 7 feet, 2.13 meters in length, and weigh up to 175 pounds, 80 kilograms. Extinction causes include hunting, loss of forest habitat, and loss of prey base. These tigers don't exist in captivity. Number 8. South China Tiger South China tigers are also known as Chinese tigers. Xiamen tigers and Amoy tigers. It is native to eastern and central China, but no one has seen one in the wild in decades. The weight of a male South China tiger ranges between 287 and 386 pounds, 130 to 175 kilograms. The female is between the weight of 220 and 254 pounds, 100 to 115 kilograms. The South China tiger is critically endangered and could become extinct. Only 30 to 40 are known to exist in the world, and they are all kept captive. There were over 4,000 South China tigers in the wild in the 1970s. When the Chinese government was clearing land for development, they killed all displaced tigers. South China tigers in the wild have been decimated due to habitat destruction and eradication efforts. Number 7. Malayan Tiger The Malayan tiger is also known as the Southern Indochinese tiger. Its native range is southeastern Asia. The Malayan tiger resembles the Indochinese tiger in appearance, but it is slightly smaller. It wasn't even recognized as a distinct breed, different from the Indo-Chinese tiger, until the early 2000s. Because of this, it has two scientific names. The scientific name Jacksoni was chosen to honor Peter Jackson, a British tiger conservationist, journalist, author, and photographer. The scientific name Malayensis was used less frequently to indicate Malaysia's geographic location. 
Male Malayan tigers weigh between 220 and 308 pounds, 100 to 140 kilograms, while females weigh between 165 and 245 pounds, 74 to 111 kilograms. The Malayan tiger population is shockingly low. There are fewer than 200 breeding adults on the planet, and their numbers are decreasing. Due to habitat loss and poaching, the Malayan tiger has become critically endangered. Number 6. Indo-Chinese tiger This subspecies, also known as Corbett's tiger after British hunter and naturalist Jim Corbett, is found in Cambodia, Laos, Burma, Thailand, and Vietnam, and was previously found in China. Indo-Chinese tigers are smaller and darker than Bengal tigers, and their stripes are shorter and narrower. Males average 9 feet 3 meters from head to tail and weigh about 400 pounds, 180 kilograms. Females weighing approximately 250 pounds, 115 kilograms. These tigers live in remote forests with hilly and mountainous terrain, making access to their habitat difficult for scientists. As a result, very little is known about the wild status of these tigers. The Indo-Chinese tiger, like all living tiger species, is endangered and its numbers are rapidly dwindling. Some experts believe it should be designated as critically endangered right now. There are only about 300 to 400 remaining. The main reason for its decline is illegal trade. There is always a demand for tiger parts because they can be used in rituals, medicines, clothing, jewelry and wines. Pelts can be traded, claws and bones ground into pastes and poultices, and internal organs eaten. Number 5. Javan Tiger The Javan Tiger is the last remaining member of the Tiger Trio that once ruled Indonesia. Little is known about it since it became extinct in the 1970s. They were last observed in Java's Meru Betiri National Park in 1976. The Javan Tiger was slightly larger than the Bali Tiger, weighing between 418 and 485 pounds, 190 to 210 kilograms. However, there have been reports of tigers in the area on a regular basis. Locals claim to have seen a tigress with two cubs in 2009, and officials discovered fresh tracks on the ground. Paw prints were discovered in the ash of a volcano after it erupted in 2010. A wildlife ranger in a national park photographed a tiger-like creature feeding on a bull in 2017. These sightings could be of non-Javan tigers. They might be leopards or other large cats, and they could be the creations of hopeful locals' imaginations. Number 4. Sumatran Tiger Sumatran tigers are only found outside of zoos on the Indonesian island of Sumatra. Scientists believe that rising sea levels separated Sumatran tigers from mainland tigers between 6,000 and 12,000 years ago. So while all of their cousins share close genetic ties, Sumatran tigers evolved differently. They are typically smaller than other breeds. They are roughly half the size of a Bengal or Siberian tiger, for example. They are only slightly shorter, but their builds are lighter and they weigh significantly less. Males are about 260 pounds and average 8 feet 2.4 meters in length from head to tail. Females weigh approximately 200 pounds 90 kilograms. Another distinguishing feature is their stripes. They have very dark, defined lines that run the length of their bodies. They even have stripes on their forelegs, which are not present in all tiger species. Sumatran tigers are also notable for being the only surviving species of tiger in Indonesia. They are critically endangered, but they are fighting for their lives. 
This distinguishes them from the extinct Bali and Javan tigers that lived in the same area. Number 3. Bengal Tiger The Bengal tiger is the most numerous of the tiger species, and it can be found in India, Bangladesh, Nepal, and Bhutan. According to the Save the Tigers Fund, India has the largest population, which is estimated to be between 2,500 and 3,750 individuals. While most Bengal tigers have the typical coloration of their species, a recessive coloration gene causes some to be cream or white in color rather than orange. Even the so-called white tigers are extremely rare in the wild. Tigers in the wild live in dry and wet deciduous forests, grassland and temperate forests, and mangrove forests. Despite having more individuals in the wild than its relatives, this subspecies is still listed as endangered on the IUCN Red List. A male Bengal weighs between 397 and 569 pounds, 180 to 258 kilograms. The female is smaller, weighing between 220 and 350 pounds, 100 to 158 kilograms. Number 2. Caspian Tiger The Caspian Tiger, also called the Hyrcanian Tiger or Turan Tiger, became extinct in the 1970s. These tigers, which congregated around the Caspian Sea, were fierce, powerful creatures with large skulls and even larger bodies. The longest specimen ever recorded was 11.8 feet, 3.6 meters long. Unfortunately, the Caspian tiger is now extinct. There are no captive ones, and they haven't been seen in the wild in decades. While it's possible that there are still undiscovered groups out there, conservationists aren't holding out hope. Caspian tigers had muted colors when they were alive. They were initially referred to as gray tigers by 19th century explorers. Surviving pelts, however, show that they had rusty orange fur with a lot of brown. Its extinction can be attributed to tiger and prey hunting, habitat loss and conversion, and the increased vulnerability of small populations. Number 1. Siberian Tiger The Siberian tiger is the strongest and largest of the tiger species. They are, in fact, the most powerful of all big cats. The striped fur of Siberian tigers distinguishes them from other subspecies. A Siberian tiger, unlike other tigers, has a mane and its stripes are fewer and paler. The animal's manes and thick fur keep them warm in the cold regions of Russia where they live. These tiger species are also found in small numbers in North Korea and China. Siberian tigers, more than any other subspecies, are largely solitary creatures. Siberian tigers hunt a variety of prey, including fish and rabbits, as well as elk, deer, and even bears. Males can grow up to more than 10.5 feet, 3.3 meters from head to tail, and weigh up to 660 pounds, 300 kilograms. Females are smaller, weighing around 200 to 370 pounds, 100 to 167 kilograms. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.